Hey, it's Miss Susan from Buena Ventura Lakes Library, and I'm here today to talk about Spot the Book. Um, the book is City Spies by James Ponty, and I wanted to talk about one of the characters in the book, and the character I'm going to talk about is Paris. Paris is a survival expert. He is the oldest member of the group, but the youngest member to ever complete, the youngest person to ever complete the military's SEER training. And SEER is survival, evade, resist, and extract. Now, hopefully you'll never have to, have to um, do any of those things. And on the rare occasion that you might have to put in some survival skills, well, there's some things that you should know. Like for one, if you're going out with your friends and you're going out into the woods like I am today, always let somebody know where you're going and what time you expect to be back. That way, if something weird would happen and you're late coming back, the people, you know, the adults in your life will know where, where you are and maybe where to go look. The other thing, take a backpack with you. Take a backpack with you with some things you may need to survive in case you do get lost and maybe you're out after dark or in the rain or something like that. And I've got this bag here and in this bag, which is kind of heavy by the way, I have a first aid kit. This first aid kit contains bandages and just about anything you would need first aid wise. Plus it has a space blanket. And that's one of those blankets that's silver on one side so that it would reflect the light if you needed to signal for help. So space blanket and first aid kit, you need that. Oh, you need a rain poncho. In case it rains. And the other thing is with the rain poncho, if, it, if you're out in the rain or after dark, you can put the rain poncho on it. It'll hold your body heat in and then put the space blanket around that and it'll really hold body heat in in case it's cold. And bring some snacks, protein bars, something, something to snack on in case you're hungry and you don't want to be out and get hungry and not be able to have anything to eat couple bottles of water to stay hydrated because you again if you're out in the hot sun you don't want to get dehydrated and the last thing that's in here is this cute little device it's a whistle in case you're lost and you need to signal for help you can blow the whistle it's very shrill has a compass on it Again, you can use the compass to find which directions north or east or south, whichever direction you need to go. There's also a magnifying glass. There's also a signal mirror, a little unbreakable mirror, and also a thermometer on the back. It'll tell you what the temperature is. It's Florida, we know it's hot. And it has a flashlight in it as well, in case I forgot to say that. So I'm gonna put all of this stuff back into the backpack and talk a little bit about what to do if you know if you're out walking in the woods and you suddenly find yourself where you're unsure of where you are and you might be just a little bit lost you should stop s t o p stop s stop stop where you are take a look around do not panic panic is your worst enemy Look around, see, see if you recognize anything. T is think. Think about how you got where you are. Do you remember seeing anything that could be a landmark to help you find your way back? Um, o is observe. Again, you're gonna observe your surroundings. Look around, is there an interesting shaped tree that you might remember seeing? And then P is plan. Plan a way to get out of where you are or come to the conclusion that you need to just stay put. So I think I'm off on my way to take a walk in the woods. I'll see you later. Oh wow, look at that cool tree. Whoa, wow, this is awesome. Where's the 
trail. I don't know. How did I get lost in the woods? Oh my goodness, what am I going to do? Oh, wait a minute. I need to stop. I need to stop. Not panic. Just stop. I need to think. How did I get here? Did I walk past anything that would be different, that would show me the way out? Did, did, and, uh, and observe, I need to look around. What? But that tree, can you be? Oh, no, 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 I can't move. I can't move. I've got to stop and think and observe. And, oh, this palm tree thing. Well, that's different, and I think I remember when I walked in, it was on my right. So that means if I walk out, it would be on my left, if I'm going in the right direction. Is that a good plan, or should I just sit down and eat my snacks and drink the water? Hmm. I think that that might be a good plan. I think that if I walk past this, and head back that way, I will find the trail. So let's see. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, I kind of remember some of this. Oh, there's the trail, I found it, yay!